had last left the Vault Dweller. They had finally blown up the Mariposa military base and also forgot to get some very important information there as it turns out. Whoops. However, now it was time to go full steam ahead. Yes, well, back to the Brotherhood of Steel and then full steam ahead to the children of the cathedrals. Cathedral! And it was there that they would finally meet and perhaps have the ultimate showdown with the Master. This is Fallout! Welcome back. Let's do it. Let's head on in. Let's see. And of course, as I alluded to there, I did, in fact, <laughs> forget about something on a, on a computer. <laughs> also, forgot to write down <laughs> exactly what it was. Uh, well, what can you do? <laughs> Let's get on in here. Now, here's the big question. Do you think our... Oh, they came with us. Wow. Incredible. All right. Now, you know what? We might be... We might finish the game in this video, or we might finish it in the next one. We will see. I guess you'll already know ahead of time if there's finale at the front of it. Okay. I might also... Maybe we'll consider splitting it up as sort of a fun way. Right? We may end prematurely as a fun way for people who just want to see the ending and all of that. And the final encounter. You know, that way it's, like, titled and everything aptly. We've done it before. Why not do it again? Let's see. Anything else of interest here? Do these doors have specific inspect text? Oh, wow, it does. A finely constructed wooden door reinforced with ornate metal braces of an almost hypnotic design. Man, I do wish I lived in some kind of fucking, like... I don't know, cottage-ass, hobbit-ass looking house that had doors like these. At least into like a, I don't know, like a garden room or whatever. <laughs> Not into like your main house or whatever, because I figure it's, I don't know, maybe it is good for insulation, but it doesn't look like it. You know, but sort of like a landing area. Alright, let's go over this way. Good. Anything over here? Alas... I can't have such a thing. So, so I'm, I built it in The Sims. <laughs> All right. What else is it? Oh, hello. Who is this? A woman. Let's inspect. She has 15 HPs. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hello, sir. Your reputation precedes you. Is there anything I can help you with? I was wondering what the cathedral is all about. How does one become an initiate? Oh, Huh. That's fascinating. Way back in the day, if you played this, like, around the time when it came out, before, you know, you had the opportunity to look a whole bunch of stuff up, or before you looked at a guide and all that, or even, even if you played it recently, and you just don't know anything about it, did you play it under the impression that maybe you could just straight up join the Children of the Cathedral as a full-on faction, and do, like, the old switcheroo against the Brotherhood. You know? Like, you double-cross them. Huh. Okay. Let's see. How does one become an initiate? Where's the master? Who's in charge here? Maybe we can just exhaust all of this. I was wondering what the cathedral's all about. Peace, love, and unity, of course. What else could we be about? But you can discover these things for yourself. Goodbye. Hang on, I want to discover more things with you. Hello again, I hope you've found this place interesting. I've seen higher forms of entertainment. Of course, sister, praise the master, praise the holy flame. You know, every time I talk to someone, people keep repeating everything they say over and over again. <laughs> Let's say that. I know, I have a tendency to do that too, when I have nothing original to say. See you later. <laughs> okay, alright, sure, I can appreciate that. All right. Let's see. Of course, sister. Praise the master. Praise the holy flame. Right. Sure. Of course. See you later. Wait, are you actually not into it? Are you also, like, under deep cover? I've seen higher forms of entertainment. This place isn't about entertainment. It's about enlightenment. More importantly, it's about making the right choices. About the destiny of the world. 
see you around. Hang on, do you want to barter? Well, you do. And you've got nothing. Okay. Let's close that. Good and done. All right. What else have we got? More folks in here? Oh, this person has a name. A chanter and Laura. Hmm. Okay. Oh, shit. Follow unity. Unity, pray, follow. Unity, pray, follow. Unity, pray, follow. Okay, sure. We're on some, like, that 1984 shit, you know? Why not? Monitor. A large monitor, black and white only. The robed figure is reciting religious dogma at a feverish pace. Okay. A large monitor, black and white only. The reception is pretty good for being indoors without an antenna. Right, yeah, that's kind of wild tech, I guess, for the world of Fallout. Right? Okay, over here. Hello there, Chanter. Hello, friend. Will you sing a song of praise with me? <laughs> Once, I was wandering blind in a land that was so unkind. I hate to interrupt your hymn, but where might I meet the master? Don't quit your day job. <laughs> Who's in charge here? I hate to interrupt your hymn, but where might I meet the master? He finds you and where and where he finds you when and where you least expect it. Praise the master, praise the holy flame, praise the world. Okay, will you say something new actually when I talk to you again? Okay. Who's in charge here? The one who sits above, the one who sits below, the one who rests within. Praise the master for such clarity of vision. Okay. How about Laura? Hello, my brother. Oh. May I be of service this glorious day? Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's see. Are you Laura? Can I ask you a few questions about the children? What kind of services do you offer? Are you Laura? I most certainly am. Did you want something? Oh shit, I forgot. Nicole sent me to talk to you. Nicole? I'm so sorry. I don't believe I know anyone by that name. Well, she told me to tell you Red Rider. Sure you do! She sent me! <laughs> she told me to tell you Red Rider. I'm sorry, I I just don't know. Follow me to a place where we can talk. <gasps> oh my god. Okay. Is it in here? Is this a place where we can talk? Oh, okay. I hope you don't mind my entourage of other folks from the followers of the apocalypse. Nicole was the was with the followers, right? Or am I mistaken? Okay. This little weird room? Hey. So, what can I do for you now? I need to ask you a few more questions. Nothing, thanks. Do you barter? No. Oh, look at her trippy-ass background. Okay. I need to ask a few more questions. <sighs> Make it quick. Wow, we can ask a bunch. Okay. Is there a secret entrance into the inner sanctum of the church? What have you learned about the master? What are the children's plans? What's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? Nothing more, thanks. So I guess we can just exhaust all of this? Okay. Is there a secret entrance into the inner sanctum of the church? It's not the inner sanctum you want to enter. Then what? I've followed Morpheus down a back secret staircase. The guy activates a secret door at the bottom. Then what? He uses this strange key to open it and disappears. I've never tried to follow him. Do you know where this key is? Why not? Oh man, here's another wild question for you. If you played Fallout 1, right, and you have sort of ingrained in your memory the get-up, of the cultists, of the children of the cathedral. They're like hallmark robes with their little hood 
and all of that. It's this kind of like brownish, almost burlap material, it looks like. It's kind of frayed and all that at the end. If you played Fallout 1 first, and then you saw Veronica in Fallout New Vegas, did any of you all who had who played in that order... Did you perhaps think that Veronica was actually because she does allude to the fact that she's a member of some sort of organization, right? She doesn't tell you right away unless you fulfill certain requirements, I think. But most people will meet her and she'll she'll be kind of mysterious. I think she'll even follow you to some degree. I can't remember exactly. But. Folks who played Fallout 1 first and then New Vegas some other time down the line, did you all think that perhaps Veronica in New Vegas was actually some sort of like long lost, like children of the cathedral member, right? Or someone trying to bring it all back because her get up is like legit this. It's this. Hmm. That's wild. I wonder if I guess maybe they were intentionally trying to evoke that. I wonder if even in some of her dialogue or your responses to her. It alludes to that as well, right? And it just went over my head because I didn't understand at the time. Huh. Okay. Uh, do you know where this key is? Why not? Do you know where the key is? Well, I'd say he keeps it on him. Oh, I need to do a little pock picking. All right. Will you show me the door now? Well, of course. Can I ask you more questions first? Okay, but we have to hurry. What have you learned about the master? Uh, not much. The children worship him, and sometimes a huge vision of him appears in the main nave of the church. A huge vision? What? How? Sounds scary. So he's real? He's real? Yes and no. I snuck up to the front one day, and I found a strange mechanical device with a lens under the altar. Probably a hollow projector of some kind. Let's play it dumb. So? So, I'm pretty sure this master is flesh and blood. And I also think I know where he is. I think the main thing that made me think of this is because I was hearing her voice acting. I was like, wow, that sounds remarkably like Felicia Day. And I was like, holy shit, Felicia Day? Yeah. Oh my god, she even looks like Felicia Day's old character, right? <laughs> or new character, I guess. <laughs> so fucking weird. Maybe it is her. Maybe it really is her. Which would even be more wild on account of them casting her as Veronica and having her dress as such. Right? Oh, that's wild as fuck. Okay. Where? Every once in a while, Morpheus will go through a secret staircase leading below the church, and he enters a secret door with some kind of a key. I think the master's down there. Yeah. Fuck, I gotta look it up. This is one of those... This is one of those I, I have to look up. Like, the connections would be too wild if they were, if she was voiced by Felicia Day. Okay. Laura, Fallout 1, voice. Oh, she is voiced by someone else. Catherine Susi, or Suchi. I don't know how to pronounce the last name. Huh. Weird does sound a lot like Felicia Day, though. I wonder if that was intentional by the voice casting. Right? Or maybe I'm just imagining things because of the outfit, right? Maybe I'm just building this weird elaborate connection where there is none. I don't know. Okay. Can you show me this staircase right now? Do you know where the key is? Where's the key? Well, I'd say he keeps it on him. Right. Will you well, show me the door? Course. I need more <sighs> questions. Make it quick. What are the children's plans? The children are setting up hospitals all over the place. I think they're trying to get people to trust them. Is it working? Is there any way to stop them? That's the stupidest thing I ever heard. Is it working? Oh, it sure looks that way. I mean, people are flocking to their church. Can't they see it's a fake? God, it really does sound like Felicia Day, doesn't it? I can't just be imagining that. They must have known what they were doing, right? It must have all been intentional, right? Okay, you sure it is? How can I stop them? Um, you sure it is? For one thing, people seem to disappear a lot around here, while the number of Nightkin are slowly growing. 
It is so wild how similar they sound. Okay. Doesn't look good, but I need more answers before I act. Why? I don't know. That's what you're here to find out, right? I guess so. Okay, let's be a horrible, horny asshole. What's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? <laughs> Waiting desperately for someone to use that pathetic line on me. Okay. <laughs> Fair response. Okay, let's see. What have you uh, learned about the master? Much. Sounds scary. Believe me, it was at first. Probably a hollow projector. So I'm pretty sure this Where? once in a while. Morpheus will go through a Show me the staircase, staircase now. Well, of course. Let's go. We're not going to like draw aggro on everybody here, right? Okay. Wow, look at this. We're doing the RP walk. Okay. Why not? Are these folks named in here too? A child with a real attitude. Another child with an attitude. Chanter of the children. A huge member of the children. Why are they huge? <laughs> okay, Sister Francis. I feel like this is gonna draw some major fucking aggro. There's warlocks in the back as well. A shopkeeper. What? Lasher of the children. What would happen if we came here beforehand? Because there, I guess there was really nothing stopping us from coming here. Only Morpheus has the key to this door. I must leave now to let Nicole know what is going on here. Yeah, you definitely need to get out of here. All right. I bet we could pick it, you know? Still, we should definitely track down this Morpheus dude. Let's do a quick save. What's the podium say? This podium is normal, except for the children of the cathedral symbol engraved on the front of it. Altar. A simple altar made from painted wood. Right. I do like that it is very similar to the Brotherhood of Steel situation, you know? Okay. There we are. Two sides of the same coin, perhaps? You see nothing out of the ordinary. It's a Mach 4 computer. A Watts Electrobox Power Generator. Fairly standard as backup generators before the war. Okay. What about this behind there? Oh, that's also part of it. I can interact with this. The screen is showing odd color patterns. Can I repair it? No. Can I science it? No. Okay, fair enough. Do they each have their own fun chant? Hello, friend. The Master's vision has made me truly alive for the first time. May I share my wonderful story with you? Where might I meet this Master? Go ahead. Who's in charge here? Yeah, go ahead. There was one... Oh, okay. The man full of hate that he nearly died. Okay. Let's see, how about you? Yeah, tell me about... Okay, yeah, nearly died. I think they've all got the same thing to say. Unless they have a unique name here. Like, are all these children with a real attitude going to have the same thing to say as the one outside? Signed out. When the hell do you want? Who's in charge here? Sure as hell ain't you. Okay, thank you. Great. Can I interact with these monitors in any way? No. Huge member of the children. Alright. Let's talk to this large adult child. You want to talk to Tun? Fine. But if I hear the word praise, I'll kill you. I was looking for someone smart enough to tell me what's really going on around this joint. You're not a big fan of worship services? What's your problem, pal? I want to speak with the man in charge. Sure thing. The only thing I feel like praising is a bottle of Rad Scorpion. A bottle of Rad Scorpion. Fine. The first one who says that word dies. Bargain. How about barter? Huh? Oh, shit. You see COC badge. Oh, children of the cathedral, right. A badge in the shape of the children of the cathedral symbol. 
On one side, you notice bumps and indentations, almost reminding you of a key. Well, you'll just sell it to me. Okay. I'll take your nicest key. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> okay. Sure. Will you really just sell it to me? Wow, thank you. Thanks so much. <laughs> okay, that's a good trade. All right. Let's see. What else? What else should we say here? You're not a big fan of worship services? You stand around this for months. And you go crazy. Go crazy as him. What do you want from Ton? How do these people get like this? These people, these zombies weren't always like this. I could even stand a few of them. Then they got converted. Some of them came out like this. Some of them didn't come out at all. Ton doesn't like it. But these people pay Ton well. All right. Tell me more about the conversion process. Did you go through the conversion process? This place is strictly low rent. Really, how much? Nobody's gonna do this to me. Why do you keep jumping between first and third person? Yeah, it is a little odd. <laughs> it is quite odd that, that you do both, you know? Rather than just committing to one. Why do you keep jumping between first and third person? You don't like the way Tun talk? Then Tun kill you. Oh shit, no! Okay. Man, I already talked to you. Take your shit somewhere else. Oh fuck. Did I quick save before talking to him? Oh shit, I think I did. Okay, yeah, because I was back in this room fucking around. Okay. Let's see, we'll just speed through this. Not a big fan of the whatever. Okay. How these people get like this? Tell me more about the conversion process. It's not healthy to ask the wrong question, compadre. They have all the answers they want you to hear. People who ask the wrong questions or people who screw up, well, they don't stay around here very long. Okay. Man, I already talked to you. Okay, okay. Let's see. Let's load. I want to get more out of you. Let's see here. Not a big fan of the services. I want sex and violence without the sex. You know where I can get it? <laughs> what the fuck? I want to speak with the man in charge. How'd these people get like this? Okay. Did you go through the conversion process? Ton go through it fine. I, uh, uh, ton, ton, just fine. Okay. Man, I already talked to you. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck? Let's see. Maybe we should ask a different question. Let's see. Fine. First one of us who says that word dies. Bargain? Agree. What can Tun do for you? <laughs> okay. Let's see. I want to speak with the man in charge. That's Morpheus. He stays upstairs except to give sermons. He don't even do that much anymore. He's smart and he's a winner. That's all that counts. Go see him for yourself. Okay. Man, I already talked to you. Take your shit somewhere else. Man, I thought we could get him to say that. <laughs> I bet you can. Hang on. Let's see. Like, if we, convince, if we somehow trick him into saying it, Will he just explode on the spot like the warlocks from before? Let's see. First one who says that dies. I want sex and violence without the sex. You know where I can get it? You talk to Morpheus or to Lasher, or you can bother Ton, and Ton give you more violence than you can handle. Okay. Go on over here. Try it again. All right. Hmm. I was looking for someone smart enough to tell me what's really going on around this joint. Oh, shit. Okay. I don't think we can get him to say, say it or really much of anything. Unless I'm just a complete fool. Let's see. Fine. First one who says the word dies. Okay. How'd these people get like this? Hmm. 
This place is strictly low rent. I used to be with the dead dog gang. Always hungry. Always tired. This place is much better for ton. Why should I worry about anything or anyone else? Nobody ever worry about me. Poor ton. Oh. <laughs> Why should I worry about anybody else? Nobody worried about ton out there. <laughs> <laughs> Poor fucking guy. All right. Let's see. First one of us who says it dies. All right. How'd these people get like this? Really? How much? You greedy asshole. Get out of here before Tun kills you. All right. Fine. <laughs> I really want to know what's going on. All right. Fine. First one who says it. Yada yada. Okay. How'd these people get like this? All right. Nobody's going to do this to me. And get out of here now before it's too late. Shit. All right. What the fuck, ton? All right. Sister Francis. Hello. I'm quick saving. Hi, I'm meditating. Did you notice? Can I help you? Sure. You notice anything unusual around here? care to share my favorite medita- any favorite meditations with me? Who's in charge here? Where can I find the master? Sure, you notice anything unusual around here? Well, Father Morpheus hasn't given any sermons in such a long time. It's a pity, because I so love his speeches, and everybody seems to be very busy with some crusade. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must get back to meditating. Can I talk to you again? Oh, it's you again. I don't mean to be rude, but I am meditating. Okay. Let's see. Hmm. Care to share any favorite meditations with me? Why, I could, but the ones who go through the servitor process are so much better than I am. Their minds are so much more focused on the master than mine. Maybe after I get changed, I'll get better. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must go back to meditating. Okay, we'll try one more. It seems like this is going to be a similar situation as to Ton. Who's in charge here? Why, that's Father Morpheus. He's such a good speaker. He really makes peace and unity come to life. And when he talks, I can just see those holy flames. That, f that Father Morpheus... He sure can talk. And he's handsome, too. All right. Oh, fuck. All right, one more. Come on, we almost exhausted them all. Where can I find the master? I think that's one of the inner mysteries that the priests discuss upstairs in the inner sanctum. I've not been privileged enough for that revelation yet, but I'm working at it. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must go back to meditating. Okay. All right. Well, let's do a quick save. Who is this again? This is Lasher. And there's a bookcase here. Also, there is Dr. Wu. I guess we'll check in with the doctor. A locked container. Can I just pop this open? You gonna mine? Whoops. Oh. To his lockpick. Failed to pick it. Okay. I definitely picked the lock. What's inside? Healing stuff. Okay. Nope. Oh, can't carry anymore. The doctor does not seem to mind. Alright. Dr. Wu, what's up with you? Hey. What is your problem, asshole? Maybe I put you to sleep, shithead! <laughs> this, is, this is how you are. Uh, do you put a lot of people to sleep, Doc? I just want to ask a few questions. Just fix me up, okay, Doc? You better not try it. Doc, I need a drink bad. Got any rubbing alcohol? I snooze, you lose, asshole. I want to ask a few questions. I'm not a library. You go outside for answers. Get out now! Okay. 
Let's see, how about... You'd better not try it. Be quiet or I'll take out your vocal cords. Debark you like dog. Ha 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 Now, you want to get out and get well or not? What's your diagnosis, Doc? You're healthy as a Brahmin, but not as bright. Get out of here, you hypochondriac asshole! <laughs> hey, um, <laughs> hey, hey, Doc. Uh, I snooze you lose, asshole. I'm shaking, asshole. Now, you want to get well or not? Do it. Just don't screw with me. Fine. It's always patch you up, fix you up, asshole. <laughs> I fucking love Dr. Wu. <laughs> oh, look. Oh, I, I've screamed Al. Ha 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 You scream like a woman. Ha 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 Dr. Wu is horrible. He's a misogynist. <laughs> All right. <laughs> They just say asshole and shithead a lot. I love it. <laughs> I can't get enough. All right. Do you put a lot of people to sleep, Doc? Night can prefer that I prefer to do that. I give them chem sometimes. Nobody pays attention to Dr. Wu. They're all assholes. <laughs> <laughs> now you want to get fixed up? <laughs> Patch it, Doc. If the Nightkin don't trust you, neither do I. I'm out of here. Just take a look and see what's busted first. I'm out of here if even the Nightkin don't like you. You little asshole! Who do you think you are to bother Dr. Wu? Stupid shithead! <laughs> what the fuck? This dude is wild as shit! Okay. Hmm. I need a drink bad. Got any rubbing alcohol, Doc? You loser! Why don't you just crawl out into the glow and lick puddles? Stupid, drunken, craving asshole! <laughs> I don't know why I like it so much. Uh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> okay, I'm an asshole. <laughs> what can I say? Let's see, can we inspect these beautiful chairs? It's a very nice looking chair. How about this bed? Very comfortable looking bed. How about the bookshelf? Anything good in there? Oh my gosh. More healing. Some rat away. Some drug. Amazing. Okay. Cool. Alright, let's just work our way through this bottom row of rooms and we'll talk to Lasher. Alright. Alright. My quarters are not open to those who have not been consecrated. I must ask you to leave at once. Forgive my intrusion, but I have important questions. I wanted to ask you about consecration. I just want to speak with the man in charge. <laughs> nice rod you got there. Is that why they call you Lasher? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Forgive my intrusion, but I have important questions. I feel like they'll direct me out of here, though. I wanted to ask you about consecration. That is not my duty. Now be gone. Will you still talk? How dare you disturb me? Don't you know how important my position is? Get out! All right. Oh, God, I can't leave. Oh, no! I can't leave! The follower of the apocalypse sledgehammer lord is in the way. I have to get closer... <laughs> I'm sorry! Please don't attack me! My friends, the four people who followed me in here, won't let me leave. Okay, I'm out, I'm out. See ya. <laughs> Alright. Let's do a quick save again, I guess. Let's check in with Storekeep. Hello, or Shopkeeper. Greetings! How can I help you? I do hope that you will take a moment to realize the significance of any future decisions you might make in regards to your soul, ellipses. What do you have for- what do you have to trade? Where can I get one of those fancy robes of yours? Let's say that. 
Only trusted members of the cathedral are allowed to wear the holy purple. I guess that answers my question. Thanks. Stuck up fool, I guess I will have to take yours. Oh, well, what do you have to trade? What do you have to trade? We have all sorts of special items to remember your trip to the cathedral. These memories can't be bought cheaply, you understand. Thanks. Right, flowers, Nuka-Cola, Radex, Psycho, Fruit, Tool, Motion Sensor, Geiger Counter, Mentats, Antidote, Radaway, more stims, bottle caps, lockpicks, beer, rope, backpack. Oh, a scout handbook. Well, I'll buy the, the stims, why not? Let's see, three, seven, zero. Boom. Okay, offer. Thank you. Okay, talk. Done. Okay. Is there anyone on the outside of the building on this screen? No, because going outside would phase us out, wouldn't it? Yeah. Oh, hey, there is a dog back here. You see Sasha? What? You cannot get there. How is there a dog out there? You see a Siberian Husky waiting patiently for her master. What? What the fuck? Oh, that's weird as shit. Okay. Huh. I guess we'll quick save. Can I go upstairs without causing a ruckus? There we are. I must use hands on stairs to ascend. Oh, look. There are cloaked robots. Oh, no, wait. They're nightkin. You see before you a nightkin. I almost didn't. 50 HP, wielding a flamer with 5 out of 5 shots of flamer fuel. Okay. Will you talk? Oh, you're angry as hell. Okay. Goodbye. Okay. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Everyone's taking a turn now. All right, I thought I was being... <laughs> okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. Hang on, let's load. Okay. Good. Let's go on up here. Now let's talk to the child of the cathedral. Over here. You see a big, strong, burly man. He's young and, is, and in his prime. Let's see. Let's do a quick save. Hello? Master, was this what I was supposed to become, master? Are you becoming right now? You're an idiot, Dane. They're going to kill you soon, and you deserve it, weakling. Weakling! Your poetry sucks, man. It sucks, sucks, sucks. Okay. I want a horse. I need a horse. Bring me a horse, damn it, a horse! They keep saying shit. Shut up, you son of a bitch! Pull yourself together! You're fools to cry for me. Never cry over spilled milk or damaged goods. I just... Oh. <laughs> okay. I just want to set the world on fire! Okay. Alright. Great. Okay, this... We're going a little fucking wild. All right, this I I guess this gives you an insight into at least part of the kind of humor that resonates more with me. <laughs> this this doesn't do it so much for me, right? But someone calling me an asshole and a shithead and getting just weirdly angry at me now that is funny. <laughs> All right. So are penguins and gyro buffalo, or is it hero buffalo? Mm. 
they shoot them out of great big bison guns. You gotta watch out for those buffalo women. They'll drop a bison on you so fast you won't know what hit you. <laughs> okay. I used to live in Pen Penticton, British Columbia. Or maybe I saw it on a map of the old days. Those were good old days. Wish I'd been alive back then. Why can't I be the important one for a change? I'm bored. What's worse, I've been screwed over. It isn't fun anymore. You ever got the feeling you were just strings and they didn't even bother to hang you? I'm all over the floor. Son of a bitch, I'm a puzzle. Will you help me put myself together? <laughs> Okay, that one, look, I can't help it. He swore at me. <laughs> All right. Why do you think they call him Master? And then there were the ones who lost their minds completely. I wish they were dead. All right. And stop him, stop him, stop him. Somebody make him stop. Shut up, asshole. Moral standards. It sure as hell ain't here. Jesus, there's a lot of unique dialogue here. Oh. Oh my god, what? <laughs> wow, amazing. Okay. I think I can finally answer some questions now. Sorry it took so long. What's this place used for? Tell me about the Nightkin. What's going on around here? What did they do to you? Who is the master? Do you want to die? I can put you out of your misery. What's this place used for? Uh, stop that. It's getting real difficult to hold myself together. Tell me about the Nightkin. Moo! 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 Brown and Nightkin coming through. Here comes some sterile milk! <laughs> oh my god! Okay. Are you still- Okay, you're still gonna moo at me. What's going on around here? <laughs> Oops. I can't keep myself together anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Let's see. What did they do to you? I used to hurt people bad, too. I was a stud. Hell, I was a god. A tough god son of a bitch. But it wasn't enough. I was a goose stepping fighting machine. But now I'm. I'm help me. Holy shit. Okay. <laughs> Who is the master? Love is what makes a cactus grow. Love is what makes a Brahmin moo. Love is screwing. It's screwing your life. I hate love. I love hate. If the master hated us, we'd all be we'd be all right. Okay. Do you want to die? I can put you out of your misery. That is life, man. It's like being drunk. Look at it one way, and it's a piss-poor embarrassment. Look at it a different way, and it feels great. But it's all the same thing. It's all life! Okay, well, what's this place used for? Okay, okay. Hang on, will you actually trade with me, Barter? No. Well, you will trade with me, but you don't got anything. Tell me about... Children? Cathedral? Master? We all have masters, don't we? <laughs> okay, brotherhood? How about... Glow? Bone Yard? Hmm. Morpheus? Is that how you spell it? Oh. Morpheus is the high priest of the children. Typically is in his rooms when he's not preaching to us. <laughs> Got very normal there for a bit. Okay. Well, talk to you later, big, strong, burly man. Let's go upstairs again. Oh, we are instantly fighting a nightkin. 
Okay, well, let's quick load. If I don't my disguise, will we be able to pass uninterrupted? The disguise has been doned. Hey, will you say something different to me now that I'm wearing the disguise too? No. Okay. Fair enough. Let's go upstairs and see what happens. We might still get attacked. Okay, we're still being attacked. Fair enough. Oh my gosh, I'm like going to die. <laughs> Alright, let's put back on the power armor. Should we kill this fucker? I wonder if we'll aggro stuff on different floors if we kill this nightkin. I don't know. Okay. Good. Now falls the death blow! <laughs> Great. Let's start blasting. Go for the eyes. Good shit. Nightkin sentry, go for the eyes. Good shit. Now are they gonna come out of this room? I just saw- yeah, there's two more. Okay. Good. Go for the eyes. I figure we may as well do this and commit to it because, hey, what else are we going to do? Like, if we... I assume if we activate that door that we were told about, that'll make shit hostile for us. Okay. Go for the eyes. And again. There we are. And in combat. Cool. Let's reload. Anything up here? Mach 4 computer. Got some bookcases. Or bookshelves. Oh look, first aid book and scout handbook. We don't really need that now though. I guess we could get a few points out of it, but meh. Okay. It's more work to try and get it into our inventory at this point. You know? <laughs> okay. There we are. And what's in this one? We got anything here? No. Okay. Let's head on upstairs again. Under attack once more. Go for the eyes. Urgh, you have earned days of agony for this! There we are. In turn. Alright, got another a-hole. I come for my enemies wielding holy flame! Oh yeah, they just decked the fucking warlock. Like, oh, it was Morpheus! <laughs> okay. Well, yeah, I don't know how we would get through all this. I guess we just gotta kill our way through? I don't know. Well, there's definitely a diplomatic way you can go about this, right? Oh, maybe it's because we got the followers with us? I'm not sure how we would get past the Nykin, though. Because they are definitely hostile to us, you know? But maybe if we didn't have the followers around us, and they weren't... Right, and then without the followers and with the disguise on, maybe that's enough to sneak by. Okay. Let's see, let's go... Can I shoot Morpheus? No. Very well. This should be quick. Alright. Oh my gosh, the follower scout has been shot the fuck up. Go for the eyes. There we are. Good. Dude, Morpheus is a fucking baby. Not another interruption. So says Morpheus. Go for the eyes again. Good. Let's roll back here. Good. Hopefully we can get a beat on- Oh! Blast from a failure, fool! Soon we'll add your- add corpse to your list of achievements. All right. Boom! Wow. Killed Morpheus like a fucking Home Alone scene. Oh. You gain 1,000 XP for destroying the leader of the Children of the Cathedral. Oh. 
Okay. Wow, I crit that motherfucker for 249. Jeez, and Pete. Okay. Let's end turn. And let's heal up. I guess from here on out, we're going in hot and heavy, huh? There we go. Let's check the bod for a key. Though maybe the key that we had gotten earlier would actually work. I don't know. Oh shit, I can't get in there because everybody is everywhere. Oh. A stealth boy. Minigun. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, one of our allies was felled. Electronic lockpick. Anything else? What have we got? Appears to be locked. Ah, I failed to pick it. There we go. What's inside? It's Tesla armor? What? This shining armor provides superior protection against energy attacks. The three Tesla attraction coil rods disperse a large percentage of directed energy attacks. And a power fist. We can unload that and take the ammo. Do I want to actually, like, try to wield it? Hang on. Let's try. Because it's power armor, right? There we go. And then... Or is it not power armor in this one? Holy shit, I can't pick it up. Okay. Well. It's time to start dropping stuff just to see what it looks like. I'm not sure that we'll use it because we don't have it, like, hardened, you know? I feel like having the hardened shit is way better. Okay. There we go. Now I can hold it. And let's wear it. Let's see here. Eh? Oh! It actually is just, like, metal armor. Except it's more sci fi -ified. Oh. This shining armor provides superior protection against energy attacks. The three Tesla attraction coil rods disperse a large percentage of directed energy attacks. Weighs 35 pounds. Huh. Weird. I wonder if it's better than power armor if you don't have it hardened. Oh, shit. Okay, I can't pick it up. <laughs> well, there we go. Problem solved. Great. Okay, let's go peek over here. Now, let's check the remains for a key. Uh-oh. There is no key. Maybe there's one in the bookshelf. There's not. Okay. Well, there are robes. There is assault rifle. Can't pick it up. Here, let's put a whole bunch of shit inside of the bookshelf, I guess. How about we throw in... I don't fucking know. Oh, let's throw in these extra robes. And then we can just pick the ones up off the ground, can't we? There we go. Good. And then we'll throw the assault rifle in there. Just as a means of clearing the floor to look for the key. Maybe this dude never did have the key, you know? Okay, then the robes. Ammo. Oh, can't take the ammo. Okay, we have to put the robes, the second pair of robes, or set of robes, or... I don't know how you refer to a robe in such a way. There we go. Take that. More of them. Okay. Now, is there any others? Ah, COC badge. Wait, is it the exact same one as before? Oh. Did I not buy the badge in this reality or something? What happened? How did I how do I not have it anymore? It's the exact same one, isn't it? I think so. Yeah. It's key-like in nature. Oh well. I mean, it works out. Like I said, I did want to go loud through here. 
Okay. Let's see. Should I get rid of this ammo? Yep. Should we take the robes just for fun? Like, what if there's a weird situation where I want them? You know? Hmm. I guess I don't need the Geiger counter anymore. Okay. There we go. Good. Now, are they going to know what went down up here? <laughs> are they going to know down there? I feel like they will. But at the same time, I feel like they have no reason to know. You know? Okay. I think we're cool. Yeah. They have no idea. All right. Great. Well, I suppose when next we come back, we are descending into the bowels of the cathedral. Right? How deep will we go? Why is there a mysterious dog named Sas Sasha out here? Who knows? Oh, shit. Wasn't Sasha also the name of the dog at the beginning of of New Vegas? What was her name? The the owner. What was the name of the the like the tutorial helper? Sunny? Sunny Smiles? Wasn't the name of the dog Sasha? Oh my god. Holy shit. I feel like I'm drawing all sorts of wild New Vegas connections this uh, fucking video. Well, two of them at least. All right. When next we come back, the secret door. It's time. Wherever it may be. It's somewhere here. Maybe this is it? I don't know. There must be some kind of cellar access or something. I don't know. Until next time, please take care of each other.